Enter ye in at the straight gate. For wide is the gate, and broad is the way that leadeth to destruction. And many there be which go in thereat. Because straight is the gate, and narrow is the way which leadeth unto life, and few there be that find it. Go over in John chapter 14, verses 1 through 6. Let not your heart be troubled. Ye believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go to prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself. That where I am, there ye may be also. And whither I go, ye know, and the way ye know. Thomas said unto him, Lord, we know not whither thou goest. Just told him. And how can we know the way? Jesus said unto him, I am the way, and the truth, and the life. No man can come unto the Father, but by me. Now, we have a protocol where we will lead to service, pray. But this morning, I was Pastor Hall back there. If you don't mind praying, no slight to my pastor friend, brother friend, Reverend Stevens. Pastor Hall, would you please pray for God's blessings upon this message? The message you please. Father, we come in your presence. God, we thank you for all that you're about to accomplish in the hearts and lives of these that are present. God, they have come, God trusting, they come believing for miracles. And God, I know you are a God that you never fail. Fulfill the desires of their heart. It, it be according to your word. And God, and help our brother this evening, God, to preach, to minister, to break the bread of life. God, and use him, God, as a tool, as an instrument in your hand. God, to allow revival to have its complete, full effect upon the lives of these that are here. And we will give you this morning all the praise. As you save those that are lost, heal those that are sick, fill those with the Holy Ghost that are powerless. And we give you all the glory. In Jesus' name, God, amen. 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 Verse 6, I want to read again, John 14, verse 6. Jesus said unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father, but by me. I want to preach this morning with God's help on the message title, There is a better way for a better life. There is a better way for a better life. How many have heard the song, Chain Breaker? Have you heard it? I'm not going to sing it to you because you'll be leaving really quickly. But allow me to share some of the words. If you've been walking the same old road for miles and miles, if you've been hearing the same old voice till the same old lies, if you're trying to fill the same old holes inside, there's a better life. There's a better life. If you got pain, he's a pain taker. If you feel lost, he's a way maker. If you need freedom, or Savior, he's a prison shaking Savior. Yeah. You got chains, he's a chain breaker. Oh, chain breaker, the chain breaker. Amen. Now listen to this part. I don't know if you're gonna clap on this part. It's later on in the, in the song. We've all run to things we know just ain't right. Let me say it again. We've all run to things we know just ain't right. And preaching, Man. that ain't good English. Get over it, will you? <laughs> Trying to do it our way. Yeah, good know. news this morning. Yeah. Jesus is. Yeah. Jesus is. Yeah. I said Jesus is. Yeah. He yeah. is our way. I was up this morning early, not too early, but early. And this verse of scripture began to run 
running through my mind, I really didn't know why, but it was running through my mind. Proverbs 14, verse 12. Hmm. There is a way which seeming right unto a man. But, but the end the end. thereof are the ways of death. God has always set up a way to do things. He set up a way for Adam and Eve to bring a sacrifice. And therefore, Cain and Abel were to bring a sacrifice. But Cain instead didn't bring a sacrifice. We call it a salad, but whatever. He brought the fruit of his, his ground, with his labor. He wants to say, well, God, this is my sacrifice. My sacrifice. But God was not pleased. God rejected him. And the Bible says how that Cain slew his brother because he was jealous of him because he offered a better sacrifice. And the Bible says when it's all said and done, Cain became a vagabond. He became a wanderer. And sometimes it's sad to see people that are homeless, that are on the streets. But sometimes in my mind I begin to wonder did they rebel against God? Have they rebelled against Him? Have they turned away from God? I don't know. But God knows. You know that music, man. That means, that means preacher, you preaching too slow. You need to speed it up. No, I got about, hold on a minute. I got still about 17 minutes now. Come on now. We just get warmed up. Oh, boy. See, King. He had had two dogs. I mean, heard of Frank Sinatra. Oh, yes. I did it my way. My I did it my way. way. But you can't do it your way and go to God's heaven. Amen. I didn't want to go to God's heaven today. Proverbs 16, Proverbs 16, verse 2. Let's move on. Proverbs 16, verse 2. All the ways of a man are clean and in his own eyes. That means clear and pure. But the Lord. Weigh the, the spirits. Yep. The Lord ponders and judges the true motives right. of our hearts. Amen. Proverbs 21, verse 2. Every way of a man is right in his own eyes. Proverbs 21, verse 2. Every way of a man is right in his own eyes. But the Lord pondered the hearts. 